Structure of Chromosomes with Classification Introduction The human chromosome complement has 46 chromosomes. They are in 23 pairs, with 22 pairs of autosomes and a pair of sex chromosomes. Chromosome Morphology Chromosomes are rod-shaped structures, each one consisting of two chromatids. They are held together at the primary constriction, the narrower area in which there is a pale staining region called a centromere. On either side of a centromere, a chromosome has its two arms designated as short arm, P arm, and long arm, Q arm. Depending on the placement of the centromere, chromosomes have been classified into four types. They are metacentric chromosomes. In these, the centromere is almost in the center, and the two arms are nearly equal in size. Submetacentric chromosomes. In these, the centromere is located between the midpoint and end of the chromosome. Acrocentric chromosomes. They have a centromere very close to one end of the chromosome. Thus, their P arms are very short, and Q arms are relatively much longer. Telecentric chromosomes. These chromosomes have a centromere at one end and have only one arm. Karyotyping Procedure of chromosome preparation from peripheral blood Collect sample of 5 milliliters of venous blood and culture at 37 degrees Celsius for 3 days. Culture media contains phytohemagglutinin to stimulate T lymphocytes to divide. Add colchicine and hypotonic saline. Colchicine prevents formation of the spindle and arrest cell division during metaphase, and cells are fixed. Spread cells on the slide by dropping. Add trypsin and stain with gemsa. Analyze metaphase chromosome spread for determining karyotype. Identifying chromosomes based on various banding patterns was suggested. Today, the Paris nomenclature is accepted all over the world. According to this, both P and Q arms consist of regions that are numbered 1, 2, and 3, starting from the centromere. The regions are further subdivided into bands to give a precise location. For example, the retinoblastoma locus is situated on chromosome 13. Its precise location is 13Q14, that is, fourth band on the first region of the long arm of chromosome 13. That's all for the video. We'll see you next time.